at least several days to readjust not only his sleep schedule but also mine because I'm usually up waiting for him to get home or I'll take a, a nap in the middle of the night and then wake up so I can be up when he gets here in the morning. So it's not uncommon for me. Anytime you guys see me upload videos in the middle of the night, that's usually why. <laughs> because I'm already up waiting on Curtis or something like that. No, this does not hurt. No, it doesn't itch right now either. Um, it doesn't usually itch until I start messing with it, but even then it's not like an unbearable itchiness. But um, it's not itching right now. I forgot to film that whole process. I, I had it at one point already filmed and then I needed space for something else so I had to delete it. So I guess I have to do a new video for that. Oh, I got my hair cut. Can y'all tell? I got it cut into like a short bob but because I have her pin curl it, um, it kind of looks the same, but yeah, it's a lot shorter. I got it cut right up to my neckline. So if I had it straightened out or wore it straight as a style, you guys would be able to tell, but I still wanted the curls. I really would like to have it shorter because I do not like for hair to touch my neck. It just makes me itchy and I don't know, I just don't like it. I don't like to sweat on my neck. Any of that kind of stuff. So, I usually try and keep it short. But Curtis likes it long, so I can't go too short. So you see some flakes coming up. So there's flakes there, but they're not ready. I do that to get the flakes off my eyelashes. Got these glitter specks everywhere. So now I just wanna clean the flakes out of my hair strands so it's not so obvious. Y'all see it? It's catching. Again, that pit just slices right through. I love it. Makes it a whole lot easier for me. There's a 
lot more hair, but I'm not going to address that tonight. I have to really stop myself because I really want to keep going. This is going to be a nice little hot spot once it's ready. Sometimes I have to move the comb in different directions to lift those scales up. Sometimes I'll do like a circular motion. Other times I'll do like a zigzag. That helps break those scales up when they're really embedded. This does not hurt, y'all. Yeah, it's catching. This is gonna be a, this whole side section is gonna be a hot spot once those scales are really ready to come up. They're so embedded right now. They're stuck, basically they're stuck to my scalp. They're not ready to come up yet, but they will be in a few more days. guys um i posted i made a post earlier um this evening uh you guys have asked so much about um getting t-shirts made and merchandise with you know mom sayings on them so i found a company to do it it's a very common um company i see it on youtube a lot through teespring and I created um, a shirt and coffee mug um, for sale. Now, it would only be available for three days, and it's in a limited quantity that I have to sell within three days. So, hopefully, you guys that were 
always asking me about it and saying that if I ever had that available, you guys would purchase it. Please click the link in the description box and purchase a shirt. Um, depending on how the sales go, um, if they go well, I'll do additional shirts with um, whatever is the most requested thing. This time it was, do you want to go to hell? Hell no. <laughs> yeah, it's in black. It's just a black shirt with white letters on it. So support your girl. Of course, you don't have to, but I'm just putting it out there if anybody's interested. And I'll also link the um, GoFundMe. Look at that. See, that's embedded. The GoFundMe I created to raise money for me to get a new camera and equipment. I'll link that. For those who are interested. Thank you to those who have supported so far. I really, really appreciate it. Um, if I don't reach the goal that I set, I'm just gonna um, use whatever um, I raised to go towards a camera and find, I'll have to come up with the difference. And of course, I'll update you guys and show you all that and post updates.